Makai Becton. Yep. And I, I worried about his weight. I've talked about his weight. I've been open about it. I've been, you know, criticizing of him. And then he gets hurt again yesterday. And all reports are telling us that it sounds like he's going to be missing the season. Is that accurate? Uh, still waiting on all the second opinions that okay. uh, he, he's got to get. But it, obviously it's uh, uh, not looking good, uh, at least from the initial prognosis. But, uh, you know, for Makai um, and any player, really, when, when stuff like this happens, you, you feel sick because they pour their heart and soul in it. And for Makai, since minicamp, he's been here every day. He's been absolutely working his tail off. And um, and for this new injury to happen, this makes everybody in the entire organization sick for him, uh, mm -hmm. mainly him, uh, because we know how hard he's been going at it since minicamp. And, uh, and even during the first couple of weeks here in training camp, the the videos of him vomiting, just getting being on a knee, and, but he constantly got up, he constantly finished his rep, he worked through all the discomfort that we knew he'd have, and uh, uh, and he fought for not only himself and his family, but for his teammates in this organization to try to get himself football ready, and for this to happen just makes everybody sick. So what is the plan now if you lose him for an extended period of time? Uh, I know you, you had a free agent visit, Dwayne Brown, I believe, was in. To, so what, I mean, where do you go I mean, with the depth? Right, right now, for us, we're, we're, we plug along next man up. I know it's a cliche, but it is what it is. Uh, I know Joe's working uh, to, to see if there's other things that we can do, but uh, we've got our faith in Chuma and McDermott. We drafted Max Mitchell, so we just got to get, uh, get those guys ready to play and, 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 and roll.